Greetings, beautiful souls. This is Emperor Chakra Wanda, host of the Living and Awaken Life podcast. And today, I want to share something deeply personal and transparent with you. When I was 14, I began a habit. Like many others, I became a part of my life. I started smoking. Mm -hmm. And for years, I struggled with it until I found, they found the strength to quit. And I lived with it free for many, many years. But when that pandemic came down, oh my God, I fell back into it. But Spirit has been encouraging me and I am now releasing and operating with a smoking cessation plan. I call it a conscious smoking cessation plan. And I'm starting with seven days and then repeating that until it's 21 days, repeating that until it's no longer there. Take a listen to this plan that was channeled through me for myself, but I want to share it with others. Start with seven days. I'm looking at starting with this upcoming September 1st, but I'm already doing it. Take a listen. Chapter one, conscious smoking cessation. Smoking cigarettes is literally a chain that binds your spiritual essence. Smoking cigarettes can hinder spiritual awakening and awareness by creating physical and energetic blockages in the body. The toxins in cigarettes can cloud the mind, reduce vital energy, and interfere with the body's natural healing processes. This can dull intuition, make it harder to connect with higher consciousness, and disrupt the flow of life force energy, prana or chi, which is essential for spiritual growth. As a result, smoking may slow down or even prevent deeper levels of spiritual awakening and self-realization. You are designed with the energy to move from the shadow of addiction to the gift of freedom. Meditate on this freedom daily, seeing it as a light that dissolves your need to smoke through the power of conscious awareness. Chapter 2. Understanding the journey of withdrawal from cigarettes. The withdrawal phase is more than just a physical challenge. It's a profound journey that impacts your body, mind and spirit. As your body starts to detoxify from the chemicals in cigarettes, you may experience a range of symptoms such as irritability, anxiety and cravings. These are signs that your body is healing and attempting to restore balance. On a mental level, withdrawal can bring about a heightened sense of awareness. The absence of nicotine allows your mind to clear offering a unique opportunity to reassess your thoughts, habits and beliefs. Embrace this clarity as a gift, a chance to redefine your relationship with yourself and the world around you. Spiritually, the journey of withdrawal is a process of purification. As you shed the physical and energetic residues of smoking, you create space for higher vibrations and deeper spiritual connections. This period can be seen as a rite of passage, a transformative experience that strengthens your resolve and fortifies your spirit. Remember, every craving, every moment of discomfort is a step towards liberation. Visualize the withdrawal process as a cleansing fire, burning away the old to make way for the new. By embracing this journey with compassion and patience, you not only heal your body, but also elevate your mind and spirit, paving the way for a more awakened and enlightened life. Chapter 3. Identifying Triggers and Emotional Patterns Understanding the deeper emotional patterns that drive the need to smoke is crucial in your journey of living an awakened life. Take a moment to reflect on the situations or emotions that compel you to reach for a cigarette. Is it stress, boredom or perhaps a need for social connection? By identifying these triggers, you empower yourself to respond differently. Journal your thoughts and feelings when the urge to smoke arises. Notice any patterns. Are there specific times of day or particular activities that make you crave a cigarette? Awareness is the first step in breaking the cycle. Once you've identified these emotional patterns, consider healthier alternatives. For example, if stress is a major trigger, explore practices like deep breathing, yoga, or even a brisk walk to release tension. Replace the ritual of smoking with a new positive habit that nurtures your well-being. For me, it is dancing with hula hoops, painting, creating content in this podcast. Work through the cravings through your creativity. Remember, smoking can create physical and energetic blockages, clouding the mind and reducing vital energy. By shining a light on your triggers and emotional patterns, 
you pave the way for a more conscious and empowered approach to quitting smoking, enhancing your spiritual growth and self-realization. Chapter 4. Physical Practices Breathwork. The throat center, which is the fifth chakra, is significant because it is associated with communication, self-expression, and truth. Engage in daily breathwork practices that focus on deep, slow breaths, particularly when the urge to smoke arises. This will also strengthen your connection to your voice and truth. Herbs. Use lobelia as a smoking deterrent. It helps reduce nicotine cravings. Mullen is excellent for lung support and detoxification. Incorporate these into a daily tea or tincture. Chapter 5. Energetic Alignment. In Mayan astrology, your role is to release what no longer serves you. Establish a daily ritual in the morning to symbolically let go of the habit, honoring each step of your journey. Chapter six, daily discipline. Start by committing to a seven day practice. I understand this may feel uncomfortable for some, but you already engage in daily rituals, such as attending to your physical hygiene. Am I not right? So you are more than capable of committing to your highest health by doing simple seven day practice and just keep repeating it for 21 days. Each morning, write down your intent to free your body from this addiction. Follow with a tea made from skull cap and passion flower to calm your nerves and support your willpower. Chapter seven, key practice, daily affirmation. I release what no longer serves my spirit. My body is a vessel of light, free and clear. Repeat this when the urge to smoke strikes and follow with deep breathing. This practice is about daily dedication, respecting the process, and honoring your journey back to spiritual clarity and freedom. Chapter eight, focus on the next level of your ability to live an awakened life. Embrace each moment with mindfulness and dedication. Your path to a smoke-free, vibrant life is within reach. Let your spirit guide you to new heights. Celebrate your victories, no matter how small. This journey is about reclaiming your power and transforming your life. Stay committed, stay inspired, and let your inner light shine. Draw strength from others' stories. Together, we rise and thrive, one step at a time. Your smoke-free, vibrant life awaits. Chapter nine. Welcome to the final part of our journey. Here's a tablet that outlines a conscious awareness approach to smoking cessation. Each morning, reflect on why you want to quit. Write down your motivations and challenges. Dedicate 10, 15 minutes to meditation, focusing on your breath. Log when, where, and why you smoke. Develop mindful alternatives like deep breathing or taking a walk. Use essential oils to create a calming environment. Engage in practices like Reiki or acupuncture to remove energetic blockages. Visualize yourself as a non-smoker, radiating health. Use positive affirmations daily. Drink teas like licorice root or green tea to detoxify your body. Consider herbs like lobelia to support mood balance. Incorporate gentle movement practices to reduce stress. Join or form a group of like-minded individuals. Soak in warm baths with Epsom salts to draw out toxins. Regularly practice body scanning meditation. This holistic approach nurtures your mind, body and spirit. So, if you feel called to embark on this journey, come join me. Know that you are not alone. We're in this together. And I'm here to support you every step of the way. Let's take this first step toward a life of greater awareness and well-being, one day at a time. Feel free to share your progress in the comments below. I look forward to walking this path with you. Until then, stay blessed, stay conscious, and stay committed to living and awakened life.